brand new week. Um, I have my second ever dental hygiene job and I know the last vlog it kind of cut off. So um, after I left, um, I worked on cloud dentistry. So on cloud dentistry, what you can do is you can actually rate each other. So I got rated and I got rated three out of five stars. And I did rate them five stars because I was being nice. Um, but uh, yeah, I, it kind of hurt my feelings a little bit. And so I haven't been like, as my confidence kind of went down a little bit. So I can't lie, I'm a little nervous for today. And I really hope today goes really well. And I just want to like, I want to smash it out today. You know, I want to do my absolute best, but I can't lie, I'm a little nervous. So I'm here nice and early like 30 minutes early and i'm ready to work but i just want to have a good 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 day so yeah i will check in with y'all at my lunch break and i will let y'all know how it's going hey y'all what it is what's up i am officially on lunch i don't know how many patients i saw this morning i did like three kid profies three kids like honestly we were just polishing them and then um I don't know how many patients I cleaned this morning. I did a perio chart. I think I cleaned about two, did I clean two? Or I think it was just three. One, two, I think it was just two patients this morning. But honestly, this office is pretty good. Like this, they say the schedule is usually busy, but it's not super busy today. Um, I felt like I got behind just a little bit, but, um, but yeah, I feel good. I feel fine. But remember last time I felt fine, I got three out of five stars. So fingers crossed, I have done a lot better this time. So yeah, I'm about to go grab a quick little something from Walmart and then I'm just gonna come back and finish up some notes, so. Hey y'all, what it is, what's up? I just finished my second day ever of being an actual hygienist. And today went really well, according to me. But we're gonna wait for that uh, for that review to come on out because last time I was hoodwinked. So I felt great about today. I felt like I did a good job. I felt like I stayed on top of things. I also felt like I helped out in sterilization. I helped out on the pediatric side. I did a lot of kid profies today. Um, I cleaned rooms. Like I really tried to keep myself busy, keep myself like, in with them you know making sure that we are all working together okay so i don't know if this is my street no this is what is this wilson no this ain't my street is wilson my street no i don't think so but a dairy queen is right there and i would love to go but no you can't do that moving at the end of july but yeah um everything went really well so i'm just gonna wait for that review and we will see what happens but yeah today was a good day um I don't have any work for the rest of the week. I should probably try to find an office to work at. I would love to just go back to that office because I'm already comfortable there. Like, honestly, I'm one of those people, like once I get comfortable somewhere, I'm like, all right, I can go back. I can go back. But yeah, um, I will check in with y'all later. Oh, I'll check in with y'all once I get that review in. We are gonna see what, uh, what they said about me. Okay. All right, y'all, we're in the clear. We got a five-star review. <laughs> I had a feeling like, the manager was awesome, Shelby was awesome, everybody was great, so. I can breathe now and I can actually feel like a real hygienist because y'all don't understand that, um, that little three out of five stars, it actually really hurt my feelings. Like I would literally didn't accept a Sunday, uh, I actually got requested for a Saturday job, but I didn't take it because I was literally like, maybe I'm not good enough, maybe I need to shadow a little more. Now I do, I do need to shadow some more, but, um, I do know what I'm doing and I gotta make sure that I don't take things too personal. Like, you know what I mean? Like it is what it is. Some people like the way you do stuff, some people don't and it just, it is what it is. And that was my first day. Take it on the chin and move on. So yeah. Hey y'all, what it is, what's up? I am on my way to my parents' house. I actually just got an oil change like right up the street cause I was due for one. And honestly, my car is driving so much better. I'm like, oh my God, why does it, why is it like my brakes are working all of a sudden? But I'm like, I got my brakes done so long ago. Like, I don't under, either way, I guess the oil and the brakes somehow work together somehow. I, I'm assuming. Uh, comment down below all the mechanics. <laughs> um, but anyway, I'm about to go to my parents' house cause I gotta pick up my Beats and my Figs, y'all. Um, I left my Beats headphones when I went to go pick up my license um, last Monday. And then, um, what else did I have over there? My figs, I just ordered my first set of figs. Uh, 
oh my God, I'm gonna look like a real professional now. I'm gonna look like I'm really that girl in my figs. I got a set of red and a set of forest green because they were on sale, baby. I bought them when I was broke, so yeah. Oh, not the G-Wag. Oh, who's riding the G-Wag? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. In the hood, honey? Who is that? I might have to do a loop around. <laughs> but anyway, then to pick this up and I will catch up with y'all whenever I have a job because I have nothing scheduled. So hopefully something pops off for me. If not, um, we just gonna be hanging out uh, at home, saving our saving the little coins that we are making. Okay, well, not little, no more, baby. Let's stop that. Cause they big bucks. They're big bucks now, honey. <laughs> big. Okay, y'all. I am officially one of those girls. I got my first set of figs. And I actually got these on sale, so I only paid $100. $98 total for two sets. Um, and my parents didn't have any food, so now I have to go pay for food. Ugh! My mom and my little brother had just got back from eating, so. And I was gonna take them out for lunch, but oh well, oh well. Um, but yeah, I'm on my way back home. I'm gonna do a quick little unboxing of these scrubs later. Get into it. Let's get into the figs. What are we gonna pull out first? The color. Okay. Okay. We have figs. So I got matching sets. So officially, I'm gonna be official. And then I also got the green. I'm like, I, of course I got the Christmas colors, but I think it's because they were on sale. And then one of these is actually a small. So that's a medium. This is a medium. And then I think well, something I had to get on the small. Oh, so the green pants, I, I had to get small. So that means I have to, I literally have to work out. Because these pants are gonna be way too little. I can get them out of the bag. But I'm eating these colors up. Okay, I need to see what it looks like on me though. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. What it is? What's up? The craziest thing just happened. I was an idiot and <laughs> woke up in the middle of the night at like 5 a.m. and I was like, ooh, they posted a shift. They posted a I shift. Think they're healthier than I am. They posted a shift and they're paying like 50 something dollars an hour. Maybe I should apply for it. I applied for it, right? And so I let it sit and then I went to check. I woke up again. It was like 7.15 or something, seven, almost 7.20. And then I'm like, oh, oh, I need to, I need to cancel this shift because I don't have enough time to drive all the way there. Y'all, why don't people accept the shift? And then I had to reach out and tell them, oh, I won't be there till nine. And they're like, oh, well, nine works. I'm like, oh my God. Y'all did not want to get up and work today. I did not want to get up and work today at all. But here we go. We're driving pretty far. I can't even lie. I think it's like an hour away. So <sighs> let's go get this bread. <laughs> I should be excited, but I'm really not. I'm really not, but it's okay. We're going to get through the day and hopefully it'll be a great day. Of course, I'm already running late, so and I had to get gas this morning. So, yeah. All right, here we go. Okay, y'all, we've made it to lunch. I have only really seen three patients this morning. As soon as I got there, I got there about 8.30. And they kind of did a little run through with me. But then the assistant was like, okay, we have a lady who's ready for perio maintenance. So I went in and did her perio maintenance. But I remember her saying something about just probing and then she's good to go so when she said that i was thinking oh like she only needs to be probed but what she meant was like she was good to go for me to do the cleaning so um yeah everything's good it's kind of easy i'm supposed to have two columns but it's not super busy today which is nice um yeah i honestly kind of got lucky with this there wasn't much traffic this morning either so i was pretty lucky i got there at 8 30 so and i was shocked that there wasn't as much traffic like I don't know why maybe it's the summer the kids are out or something i don't know 
but yeah it's going well i think so i don't know if they can review us on this app so i'm always nervous about that ever since that first day i'm like I don't know, it could be seem like it's going perfectly and they gonna cut me up as soon as I leave. So I don't know, you know. I would, I'm actually heading to Kroger. I'm just gonna get a salad or something real quick and a Topo Chico and then I will check in with y'all later. Okay y'all, I am eating lunch in my car like a real, um, I think everybody eats in their cars now. Like a, a true loser that I am. But, I just got off the phone with one of my friends. And I think I may have been like insensitive to what she's going through. Um, Cause I mean, life's not amazing, you know, but life is good right now. Um, and I was just mentioning that, you know, I was getting paid pretty well for this job, but um, earlier she was obviously we were having a conversation talking about how you know finances are a struggle too so i think i was being really um tone deaf and very inconsiderate of her feelings and um yeah i feel bad but yeah i should have thought about what i said i should have like thought about what i was gonna say before i said it um but honestly i i have to work on that like as a friend sometimes i'm like not like I'm typically like a solution driven person like me I, like I like to sulk and be upset about it but usually I internalize that and then I like to look for a solution like immediately so I have to stop doing that and I have to just like sulk and be sad with my friends and let them feel their feelings and feel it with them and like you know yeah just be a little more aware a little socially cognizant of the things that are going on so yeah yeah just have to say that one more thing this little area it got the menses y'all like it got the menses and I'm talking about the menses with the coins it giving like tech money oil money like that's what it's given around here you know you can tell by the outfits you can always tell by the outfits but because they always got them damn y'all know them little khakis or them little weird little pants with that tucked in polo y'all already know so they got some money over here and I mean there were some lookers we'll say that there were some lookers no work today, just, well, this is work today. Tiny desk, get into it. Don't, don't say I never told you nothing. Hey y'all, what it is, what's up? I am so sad. Oops. And my apologies, I did not make a video this morning. I did go to work. Um, it's Saturday. I went to work from, I went to work from 8.30 to 3 p.m., I mean, come on guys, the light is green, so they could wait. You don't have to... See, that was me nice road raging. I'm not always I'm not always yelling and cursing. But anyway, I worked today. It was cool. Um, it was assisted hygiene. I felt like I was a little slow today, but why did I wake up in the morning and I felt like I was hungover? Like my stomach was hurting so bad and then I just literally could not stop. You know that hangover feeling whenever you're like, literally you can't stop um vomiting like you just like every 20 minutes or so so literally driving to work literally driving to work i had to throw up in a trash bag and like you know it was just like that yellow nasty bile i'm sorry for this tmi but like y'all i don't know what was going on but then i thought about it and i had ordered like this burrito from from this place called the taco stand and Okay, I ordered two, it was two because I got buy one, get one free. But one of them, I had fell asleep, I had brushed my teeth, I went to sleep, and then I woke up and forgot to put the other one in the fridge. So when I woke up, I put it in the fridge, and then the next day I ate it like it was normal, and I honestly think that gave me food poisoning because baby, my stomach, I'm telling you, it's been knotted, like it was knotted up. Like I was like, oh my God, what's going on? Like. I was actually getting nervous and afraid. Like I was getting so nervous, but I honestly, it's time for me to go to the doctor anyway, but today was a great day. It was assisted. I mean, 8.30 to six, no break. I mean, 8.30 to three, no break. Um, but I mean, I get off at three and it's Saturday, so there's no traffic. So yeah, um, everything's great. I will catch up with y'all next week whenever we 
possibly i don't know i don't have a job technically monday i apply for a job and we will see if i get that temp shift but i hope y'all enjoy the y'all's weekend enjoy y'all sunday i will catch up with y'all monday bonjour comment ça va tu uh, je suis dans ma voisin <laughs> je suis dans ma voiture et je vais à uh, la maison dans du la maison du Michi y'all my french is so bad but what it is what's up i am in my car we're on the way to Mitchie's house. Y'all know Mitchie. If, if you know, comment and like down below. Girl, I ain't got them people. <laughs> On our way to Mitchie's house and me and Mitchie are gonna have Sunday fun day today, which I'm super excited about. Okay, why is this road closed off? Like, it's so annoying, but it's fine. Um, here, let me show y'all. Like, the freeway, we get one lane. Now, typically, we got like five. We only have one for now. But okay, so we're on the way there. Me and her are gonna go hang out. We're gonna have Sunday fun day. We're gonna catch up and yap, yap, yap. And yeah, I'm excited. We're going to Fieldings and we're gonna go hang out with Darlene. Well, hopefully she's there. She usually works on Sunday. So hopefully Darlene is there. And y'all know Darlene, if you have watched my graduation video, she's the one who got us the free shots sent over to the table and got us the little VIP experience. So yes. Um, what is going on here? I knew I should have checked my maps. I knew I should have checked my maps. But I'm gonna I'm check in with y'all later because I'm not about to deal with no traffic. That's all I know. It's Sunday Sunday. Cheers. Cheers to the girls we did. We have 43 minutes to finish these, according to Darla. <laughs> here we go. Guys, having a dragon's breath. Mishy's having a whatever that is. Hello. It's a good time. You ready to be on the vlog? Yeah. Uh. <laughs> Cheers. <laughs> I may or may not be drunk. May or may not. Anyway, honestly, there is. Hold on. Let's talk about how there is no one else. There is no one else I would rather be here with. That's what she did. No one else. You know what? All right, guess what? Um, I don't know if y'all know, but yesterday or the other day I ordered on Amazon, I ordered some new headphone, um, cuffs or whatever the f and, um, what else, to, and some new scrub caps so that I could actually have some new ones. And then I also ordered whatever's in this new package that I got. So I fixed my, um, beats yesterday. So my beats are um, completely fixed. I have some Studio 3 beats and they, um, I snapped them in the gym and then after I snapped them in the gym, the little um, headphone thing started to fall apart. So like it got real ugly and weird. So I ordered some more and I fixed those parts. And then, okay, just to confirm what I'm talking about, I replaced this part of my beats and then I also replaced this hold on that part of my beats <clears throat> like the little earmuff part they were falling apart because i had them since 2000 and i don't know what year and so i fixed it so now they're like practically brand new i ordered i know for sure i ordered a keyboard cover oh and socks that's what i ordered socks so i ordered dental socks so there's, oh, they're all different colors. So I ordered dental socks and they vacuum sealed the f out these hoes. And then I ordered a keyboard cover for my Mac. I got a new keyboard cover because originally my keyboard cover was this. And then the E, I don't know if you can notice, but the E, <laughs> the E, for some reason, we obviously use the letter E a lot in the English language. I'm not gonna lie, this kind of pissed me off a little bit because I obviously ordered the wrong keyboard cover. 
because look, so I have to order another one. That's like incorrect. Baby, tell me what you like. You're the only one I want to have for all.